And basically, when we have two inverters that only invert one leg, what we have to do for a 50 amp rig is splice in, uh, or bring it in, and then break it out so that each inverter will invert one line. And doing that with these two breaker boxes. So red for me signifies power in. That's gonna be coming from the transfer switch, which will be wired up over there later on. <clears throat> power coming in and having a disconnect here so that worst case scenario, he can actually bypass both of his inverters, disconnect right here, connect those lines together, which you'll see at the end. And then he uh, runs shore power directly to his breaker box. Uh, but in the meantime, we got both of these. So we got power coming in, splitting out. So we got our leg one, leg two, going through a breaker that we can turn on and off. We got our neutral going through a neutral bar inside here and then splitting out into two neutrals. And then we got our ground coming in here into this uh, connector and then splitting out into two grounds. From there, we're splitting out leg one or leg two rather going into this inverter leg one going over here to this inverter and it comes back out goes into this box where i got leg one leg two going back into the breaker you got the ground and the neutral coming into their respective bars and then rejoining into a singular 50 amp cable that'll go back out over there to the breaker box which is in its temporary location and that's how you do the AC wiring to wire two inverters uh, to be able to be a 50 amp rig.